You know, now that I think about it, it's gotta be really goddamn hard to be patriotic in Germany. <laughs> like, think about it. If you're patriotic, like, God, I love this country, it's like, well, um... How far back do you love this country? Because <laughs> 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 it's... <laughs> 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 Do you like this country? <laughs> it's a serious question, though. <laughs> it's like if someone says, like, I like, it's like, I like this country all the way back to 1939, I think there's a fucking problem. <laughs> like, <laughs> you'll be like, wait, what? <laughs> I mean, World War One really wasn't that bad. <laughs> like, they were just kind of helping their neighbors out. And then they got royally fucked for it for no reason. It was like, oh, you had this happen. Okay, we'll help you. And then just at the end of the war, for some reason, Germany got fucked over five times more than they deserved. <laughs> they, they just like, oh, we, we like helping people, so that's what we're going to do. It's like, hey, these guys are our neighbors, and they're uh, I forget. We don't want to have bad enemies. We don't have our neighbors as enemies. We want to build an alliance. Yeah, here, wait, let me look it up. Who did Germany side with in World War One? Austro-Hungary, Bulgaria, and the Ottoman Empire. Okay, who was killed that started World War One? Akduk Franz Fr Franz Ferdinand, and he was Austro-Hungarian. Okay, <laughs> that makes sense. So it's just like Germany in World War One was like, damn, you're like high up Austro-Hungarian dude got killed, and you suspect it was this country. That's kind of fucked up. Okay, cool. We'll help. It's like we'll we'll be on your side of this. It's like, oh, okay, thanks, buddy. It's like four years later. Oh, God, Jesus Christ. We're getting taxed so horribly bad. We have to reduce our military. We're, it's like, we have to pay off millions of dollars because of all the damage we did to uh, France and shit. It's like, oh, okay, this is, this is bad. This, this. This is bad a couple years later, just like a horrible depression. It's like... And then, random guy that was served in World War One with a funny mustache is like, You know what? We should make a party. It's like, okay, wow, that sounds like a great idea. A couple years later, Jews are getting sent to the camps, everything's going to shit. It's like, what the fuck? Wait, what? Well, how did this start? Man starts invading things. Hey, we might be going a little too far. British declares war on Germany. Oh, God. Oh, oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Blitzkrieg, Blitzkrieg just, happens. Just, Germany just, again. Oh, wow. Wait. We might win this war later because Hitler's a fucking idiot and decides to invade Russia when they literally had a truce. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, okay. All right. That interesting plan. But, uh, 1943. Oh my fucking- Oh god. Oh- Oh god. Oh. Oh god. Alright, at least we have friend 1944. Oh Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, this is getting a little bad, but it might be 1945. Dear god, holy f- How did we lose this goddamn bad? Who knew we got all the way through France in like four months? How did we fuck this up? So bad. We have Russians knocking on our door. We have Americans, British, Canadians. We have so many people. Knocking down our doors. <laughs> we are royally fucked. <laughs>